hi guys welcome to the new year new idea and new success in today's video i'm going to show you guys how to increase your cpc on adisync if you have google adisync on your website and you want to increase your cpc i'm going to walk you through step by step guide give you some few uh you know road mapping you're going to use to increase your cpc just give me your three minutes of time i'm going to explain in this diagram exactly method you're going to implement to use it to increase your cpc so your revenue your google adsense revenue will increase if you want to really make money with google adsense even though you are running a paid traffic this is still the same method of you know optimizing your ad to increase your cpc if you have low cpc bother no more give me three minutes of your time and i will show you exactly method to implement and what i want you to do for me in return is to subscribe to my channel turn the notification bell and once you update anything a good content or aco or backlinking content or anything concerning cp cpa or cpc anything concerning google addison you get notification let's go straight to the point now to increase your cpc is very simple and this is one thing most of you are facing in terms of uh, you know increasing your cpc uh, the number one thing you, you need to consider is your ad placement i keep on saying this even when i told you guys on how to use axterra or propeller to increase your ad revenue your adsense revenue to increase your adsense earning i also explain to you guys how to do ad placement the reason because if your ad is not in a position where users can be able to see your ad your banner they cannot click on it because it's once they click is once you are earning so uh, which is cpc cost per what click so your ad need to be in a good placement in a good position so the users that are reading your content or your visitors that come to your website will easily you know uh, click your ad and this is what i listed out here which is the seven uh, improvement you need to take in your website to increase your google adsense uh, cpc so if you check i mentioned uh, uh analyzing your ad placement make sure you check out your ad placement make make a good position for your ad and also get quality traffic and getting quality traffic most times depends on your content don't copy content if you want to get a good quality traffic you don't need to copy content you need to do some research write good content and also even though you're shooting a pay traffic make sure the pay traffic you are shooting the content to is our uh, let's say for example if you are running a scholarship website don't sh uh, go and buy uh you know usa traffic to shoot on it or run a usa traffic ad to your scholarship website is not a good advance uh you know it's not going to convert very well so run a quality traffic you know get quality traffic because quality traffic is going to increase your cpc and what again is going to increase your cpc is content so more users find your content more interesting and this is just like creating more quality content because that's the only thing that can fetch quality traffic the next one which is the third one is do uh keyword research most of you ignore this make sure you get keyword research do some keyword research find a good keyword uh, uh you know keyword uh yes get a good keyword that is going to you know have a good cpc go for good keywords that have good cpc use it optimize it on your content and write a good content towards the towards that keyword make sure you have a good keyword do some keyword research to increase your cpc the next one is content structure in this case most of you don't really know how to structure your content one thing the easiest way to increase your uh, content structure let me also give me your time just four seconds let me log into my website to show you what you need to do in terms of content structure now the first thing you need to do on content structure let me go by this place go here uh, let me log into one of my texting websites just give me your time it's going to be very very easy so let's say for example here let me click this thing let's say for example here if you if you do a keyword research and you find out that uh the keyword you're targeting is dog food and dog food is 
uh, CPC of $1,000. The easiest way to optimize your content is make sure that that keyword appear on the uh, on the title, appear in the H1, appear in, which is your title, appear in the H1, H2, and also make sure that that keyword appear inside image description. This will engage the value of ad because there's a particular API from Google that is going to read your content page. So that's when they will analyze the keywords you mention on your pages and what your image is talking about. That's the right time for them to pull out a reasonable ad for you because even though you have a uh, ad showing on your website, most time most of them are low CPC ad. So the easiest way to increase your CPC is to make sure that the image you are going to embed in your content have the keyword you are targeting save it with the keyword you are targeting and make sure that you add the keyword you describe the image make sure you let me show you something uh i'm going to take my time just give me your four seconds it's not going to be more than four seconds i know most of you have started counting seconds so if it's a dog food dog food have cpc of four dollar now make sure you mention dog food in your h1 make sure that dog food appear in your h1 make sure that dog food appear in your h2 and make sure that dog food appear in your description the content description and make sure the image you are going to upload contains this keyword you save it with dog food and also make sure the octa text let me also show you what i mean by that uh let me check if i upload this image now that means inside this image i'm going to add dog food here okay dog food here if you think google don't read this thing google read it because this is the only way to, for them to find a reasonable ad that is going to convert for your users so make sure you take your time construct your content very well structure it in a good way make sure you mention the keyword you're targeting in your h1 in your h2 in your meta description and also your images contain the keyword you are targeting so the next one we talk about here after content structure is website structure website structure is one of the best thing uh you know that is going to increase your cpc depending on your website design design a mobile friendly website because most of the users that is coming to your website mostly are mobile and they are high in mobile so now what you need to do is to customize a nice mobile friendly website that can contain a ad format like this if you check here you're going to see something like header and after header ad let me take this thing off after a header ad you're going to see content after content you get another ad which is the second paragraph after the content you get a little content depending on the length of your content you will see another ad again so you're going to embed two ad inside your content okay and one for the header to add uh add send add unit on the content and make sure you have your conclusion this is this place means conclusion this is still the body this is the starting uh, paragraph which is the h2 so make sure you place your ad in this way and make sure you have your sidebar ad i keep on mentioning this because this is the simplest way again to increase your uh you know increase your cpc and revenue because once your cpc is high your addison earning is going to be high and make sure you own your auto ad this is another way of increasing your cpc and again the last one you need to understand about placing your ad make sure you do not place multiple ad in short content if your content is that uh 5000 works 2000 works which is well optimized content is not a script content is a reasonable content and that solve users problem and is long content you can place more than three ad on your content okay but if your content is within the 2000 1000 or 1005 or 2000 works you can place two ad units inside your content and your sidebar ad and auto ad and what header ad the next one you need to do to improve your cpc to increase your addison cpc is to you know your website niche this is the number one thing everybody need to consider one of the niche that is going to give you a good cpc is uh finance uh insurance uh crypto let me mention them travel and there's a lot of tech niche 
these are the type of niche that is going to travel uh, insurance uh, business crypto or uh, mention them these are the kind of niche that can be able to increase your cpc so when you're starting to use adsense or you are planning to use adsense to start any money make sure you pick a niche that is going to pay you very well don't just pick anyhow niche make sure you pick a good niche one of the easiest way the last one i'm going to mention before i end this video and what i want you to do for me if you like this video smash the like button that's the only way to increase my energy to continue publishing a nice content on this channel then the last one you're going to consider is your on page seo your on page is to still content content optimization doing some keyword research you know keyword placement make sure you place your keyword make sure you place the targeted keyword that have the cpc on the ad on the content on your image make sure the keyword appear on the image make sure the keyword appear on different angle but don't sp uh, spam the keyword make sure your keyword appear your keyword the targeted keyword appear not less than 20 to 15 times in the long length of content of 2000 works or even 1500 works make sure you optimize your home page very well your website speed make sure you correspond with the website speed and make sure you optimize your own page SEO. your home page SEO is also going to increase your what your cpc in my next video i'm going to show you guys the simple method you're going to use to optimize your home page seo in 2022 see you guys in my next content bye peace out